Hey guys, welcome back to Matlock's Toy Room Reviews, and today I'm continuing with the Mighty Max figures. Um, this is the uh, Mighty Max Survives Corpus. Um, this is one of the horror heads, which again is one of the smaller sized. Very cool looking head, if you can see just the, the creepy stuff they put on these. Um, you know, as a kid I didn't really notice the creepiness of it, but I... Uh, He's got like green snot coming out of his nose and these crazy like metal stitches just along the, his head. And it's got like some yellow like larva or bugs coming out. He's got a giant hole in his head. Just the, the overall creepiness of these things was, is just really cool and uh, you know it's kind of crazy they marketed these to kids. I mean naturally it's a kid's toy but you know just with all the, the wild stuff they did it's just kind of crazy. Anyways, let's uh, pan down here. Uh, this one actually opens up kind of interesting. It doesn't open if you see the little tabs over here on the side instead of just on the bottom like normal. Um, pop the tab like normal, but just kind of opens up a little weird. And then uh, this comes up in two different parts. So in the top we have just kind of the staircase that goes around and of course you could have just one side up or the or both of them but I just saw kinds of different skulls and things there's a little torch in there it's very cool so a kind of dungeon-esque thing going on um, some of the figures you get this uh, kind of creepy looking miner he's got like a light on his head and stuff of course, your Mighty Max figure. And then you get this uh, creepy looking zombie guy. Let's see if I can uh, zoom in on him just a little bit. Very creepy, tall, linky, skinny, but a very cool character. I like that. And on the inside and the bottom, you can see there is two places for Mighty Max to stand, and then one place for the the miner, and then of course the zombie can lay in the casket there. So very cool. Uh, little simple play sets, but very cool. Made by Bluebird Toys back in 1992, but uh, this one actually says 1993. I think this is from Series Three, and that's why. But uh, these were. Made by Bluebird and released in the United Kingdom, but were brought to the United States, uh, you know, a little after 1992, and were actually um, distributed by Mattel in the States. So that's kind of cool. Anyways, that was Mighty Max Survives Corpus. Thanks for checking it out.